Hi, and welcome to Therapeutic Thursday. I thank you for joining me today. And I'm going to go over the first five days of the 30-day health exploration. If you've already started and gone through these five days, that's awesome, keep on going. And if not, we can start here today together. So day one is to try a deep breathing exercise. You could get one off of YouTube or even Googling, or we could try one together. So for this exercise, I invite you to find any comfortable position. Maybe that's standing up, maybe that's sitting down, or perhaps today that means lying down. Please use any pillows or blankets that you would like to. And you can either choose to soften your gaze or if it feels comfortable, closing the eyes. And just begin to notice the breath, noticing the inhale and noticing the exhale. without any need to judge or fix or change anything, simply noticing. And now explore if you can invite that breath deeper into the body. Perhaps a longer, slower inhale, followed by a long, slow exhale. And when you're ready, allowing your breath to find its natural, rhythmic beat, And that could conclude your day one. For day two, it's watch a silly video. And this might be a fun video that you have on your phone, maybe of your dog or pet or of your kids or of a friend. Or this could be a video that you look up on YouTube or TikTok, one that makes you laugh. For day three, it's take 10 minutes to read. And so maybe that means just setting a timer on your phone for 10 minutes and finding any book that's calling to you that day. Maybe it's reading a chapter book. Maybe it's reading a picture book. Maybe it's reading a kid's book. Any book that's calling to you that day. And then for day four, it's cross an item off your to-do list. And so this could mean anything. Maybe it's to get one load of laundry done. Maybe it's to go for a walk. Maybe it's to organize maybe a cupboard or something in your house. So that can look like a variety of different things and just choosing one that you would like to get done. As small or as big as you'd like. And then for day five, it's plan a healthy meal. And so that could mean breakfast, that could mean lunch, that could mean supper, or that could mean the snacks that you have in between. And so that might mean having a bit more of fruits and vegetables, or maybe just having some more water. Or maybe that means having one less pop or one less sugary treat that day. Or that could mean having a full, big cooked supper meal that is covering some of those basic food groups like fruits and vegetables, something that makes us feel good, that's healthy and helps us fuel our body. So you get to choose if you would like that to be one big meal or if you'd like that to be a snack or if that means just cutting something out from that day. So I thank you for joining me for the first 
five days.